Hey everybody, Black Ninja 797 here, and welcome back to another video, guys. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up Steam Link. So, for Steam Link, for those of you guys that don't know what this is, basically, this is a feature that allows you to essentially play your Steam library through your mobile device. Now, for me personally, I've been doing this recently for playing Left 4 Dead, and you guys have gotten a massive kick out of it, and I said if any of you want me to make a video, just please let me know. And uh, some of you guys really want the tutorial pretty badly, so I'm more than happy to show you guys how to set up Steam Link. So what I recommend that you do is that just watch the video throughout the entire thing, so that way you know every single step, so that way you don't get lost and get confused, but I will try to make this as short, as fast, and as clear as I can. If you end up enjoying today's video by the end, please drop a like just before you take off. I would definitely appreciate it, but yeah, guys, let me show you how to set up Steam Link. So the first thing that you need to do is you need to end up finding the Steam Link app. So this is available on Android and on Apple devices and it's going to be specifically called Steam Link. Not anything else. You just want to specifically get Steam Link. It looks like this and when you install it that is already the first step and then we can move on to how to actually set it up. So now you should be greeted with this screen right here where it says welcome to Steam Link and you end up hitting the blue get started button. Now you should be greeted with this screen which is going to be the pair controller screen. So now you have a couple of options here. Either A, you can just deal with the normal touch controls by just using your thumbs on your phone like you would normally play a mobile game, or you can end up using one of the two controller methods, which is going to be just a Bluetooth wireless controller, such as an Xbox or a PlayStation one, or you can use a custom Steam controller. Now, for me personally, I just use my normal fingers. I don't use a controller because I really don't mobile game that much anyway. And when I do, it's for a like challenge and to be immersive in the mobile experience. So I thought I'd just use my thumbs because it's the most authentic. So if you guys want to figure out how to set up a controller specifically, I recommend looking up an additional video alongside mine. But for me personally, I just use the normal touchscreen control, so I'd use the very right option. Then what you want to do is you want to open up your Steam, and then when you go to your Steam, go to the upper left hand corner, scroll down to settings, and then you want to go over to the remote play option, which is going to end up showing this. So within this option right here, you want to end up connecting your computer to your phone because this is how you do it. So whatever device that you game for Steam the most often, whether it be your desktop or your laptop, you want to use that specific device. So then what you want to do is hit the option called pair Steam Link. Now, once you do this, you're going to be greeted with this on your screen. Now, this is going to be the step that I feel like most people mess up the most is because this is going to be just flat out connecting your phone to your computer. Now, in order to do this, you need to be on the exact same Wi-Fi network for both devices because otherwise your computer will just not be found so whatever your wi-fi is or your internet signal that you use for your computer make sure that's also what your phone is on and i do also want to stress something that i don't know if a lot of other people have addressed before but this is something that's happened to me personally is that this also includes not using a vpn because for me personally i use nordvpn it's just a way to keep my internet safe however though when i use it i cannot use steam blink it actually doesn't let me so if you have a vpn even though you're on the correct internet it still might not work for you because it's meant to encrypt your data so make sure that you're not using a VPN either okay so for the next step on your phone there is going to be a number code you want to take that number code and put it here on your computer you want to go back to your computer and type it in right here it's going to look just like this on your screen and you want to type in that number code and then you will be able to connect your phone finally to your computer it should look something like this after it's done loading and you just end up hitting the OK button. And then finally, after you do that, all you have left on the screen left to do is just to hit the start playing button. And then finally, you will be able to play your PC games from your Steam library on your phone. And the cool thing is too, is that you're going to be seeing this in real time. Your phone is basically going to be controlling all of your computer. And what it allows you to do is not only be able to see what your computer is doing relative to Steam, but if you're actually navigating your mouse and keyboard on your phone, you can actually see other things such as just like your background, your computer, all your other programs like Discord, uh, you know, YouTube, all that stuff because they're linked now and all it is is just drawing kind of like a parallel and it essentially acts like a second monitor and it's really really cool but yeah guys fundamentally that is how you set up steam link i do hope this tutorial helped you out and if it did please drop a like comment and subscribe to show you guys support if you guys would like to financially support the channel i tremendously appreciate it. you guys can go check out my patreon it's always linked down below in all my youtube video descriptions or you guys can use supporter creator code black ninja 797 in all caps and the fortnite big games item shops because epic is my very first sponsor and they're sponsoring today's video so shout out to epic games 
But yeah, guys, I hope you end up enjoying seeing another YouTube video for the most unique YouTubers you're ever going to see. Thank you for watching, guys. I love you, and peace out. Happy playing. Hey, meme lords. Jesus here. And you better have enjoyed that video there by the eternal god Daddy Ninja. You should probably subscribe, too. Or the mighty Moab will come for your balls. If you enjoyed the video, you might like it, too. And... Give me the memes. Flash, bang, boom.